Hello and welcome to IT Army. Sometimes it's required to convert your logical partitions to primary partitions. For instance, you are trying to convert your windows from legacy to UEFI mode installation. So in that case, you need to convert your all the logical partitions to primary partitions. So let's see how to do this operation. So if I go to disk management by right clicking the start button and go to disk management, and then you're going to find that I have two partitions over here. Uh, C drive, this is the system reserve partition. We have C drive and D drive and this is the logical partition. So out of the box, Windows doesn't provide you any option to convert a logical partition to primary partition. The only option would be that you move the content of this drive to some other drive and then you delete it and create a primary partition. But if you have a lot of content inside there and you don't want to move that content and delete that partition you can use some third party partitioning utility so i'll be using easus partition so it's available for free you can head on to easus.com and you can go to partition manager partition master free software i have already installed so i'll just click and it needs elevated privileges and there you're gonna see that i have these two partitions and from the logical partition i will be converting to a primary partition so this is the partition i want to convert so select that partition and on the right hand side you're going to see what are the operations you want to perform so i want to perform the convert operations so if i click on more and there you're going to see we have option for convert to primary so i click on that and click on execute one operation click on apply and then you're going to see that drive got converted to a primary partition. Okay, so it got finished and you can see both are now blue. You can also verify from File Explorer. You won't see any difference. They are showing as normal drives. But if I right click and go to Disk Management, you can see now showing that both of them, they are the primary partition. So this is how we can convert the logical partition to a primary partition. So I hope you like this video. And if you have any other questions or comments, please post in the comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next video.